Sacred land is headed back to the hands of the Weah tribe. The Eureka City Council has voted to begin the process of returning uh, to a Indian island to the tribe. It is a dream come true for the tribe's oldest member who died Thursday. Dave Silleran is here to tell us about a special lady who lived to hear the news of a lifetime. Dave. I spent her I spent her 103rd birthday with her last March and before she passed away last Thursday Evelyn Horn got the news she had been waiting for her sacred land will soon be returned to the Weot tribe Yeah you tribal Yes nothing Not much made Evelyn Horn smile like the eel brought to her by her grandson brought to Granada Care Home She was joy and wisdom. She was great. Evelyn, for, for me, Evelyn always held the two tribes together, Bear River and, and the Weah tribe. A Weah tribal member from Table Bluff, she loved her culture and everything about it. Before Evelyn passed away at age 103 this week, she received a gift far greater than her family and her eel snacks she would learn that the sacred ground of her ancestors would likely be returned to her tribe, a decision made by the Eureka City Council this week. Her grandson, Alan Miller, had the chance to tell her. So the day, her last day, you know, I went and seen her, and it was, you know, Grandma, we got back our land. Um, she just lit up, she smiled. Mm -hmm. Now on the Table Bluff Reservation, tribal members are preparing for Christmas. And when they can, they'll go to a bluff overlooking the bay. And from it, they can almost see Indian Island, the sacred spot. And they can feel the presence of Evelyn, who became a symbol of strength and weot spirit. I, I do feel a little alone right now, it sucks. She, she's always been there in my life. It's like those eels you ate with her. You know, for like what, 25, almost 30 years, I've been taking her eels. She's yeah. the first one to get eels every time I went and caught them. Now the real thing is going to be really hard. Is, you know, who do I take those eels to now? Dave Silverbrand, Redwood News. And now her survivors are looking for a way to honor Evelyn's memory, and I've promised to help them do just that. Manny?